Jessica, no intro day. Had some technical difficulties. First off, and let's get racing here from Road America. The engine sounds are back, yeah! And it's 4th of, of July racing from Road America. The first Cup Series race here since 1956. Oh, around goes Ryan Blaney. No caution for Ryan Blaney. Think he's gonna be all right. He spun around, hit the wall hard. Oh, slow going. Well, he's slow down in this turn right here. Bill Walker's taking advantage of that. He's gonna get to the 19 of Martin Truex Jr. As Agano started all pulling this race. I was gonna get in the back of the trucks there. Speaking of Christopher Bell running in the sixth place position, he's won an Xfinity race. The last time he was here, he won. That was an Xfinity car. And um, coming up on fifth place, Kyle Busch, who won his 101st Xfinity race yesterday. Um, that race was pretty wild. And Walker will run the Knoxville truck race at his home track. He lives three hours away from that track. As well, his home track is he currently resides in Lake Norman, North Carolina. But his home track is DeWitt, Iowa. And this is his home track that we're at this weekend's home cup track it was about five hours away from here coming up on the five Kyle Larson driver who's been kind of strong this year two wins on 2021 so I gotta guess here this is probably gonna be another oh caution free race says Dylan Walker nearly goes in the sand traps I know you barely did it's gonna go up this hill We got one lap to go in the stage, only nine laps in this race. We got one lap to go in stage number one. Now road course racing is special type of racing. Um, especially here on the 4th of July, first, first 4th of July race since 2009. Um, back in Daytona where Tony Stewart won that. Logano is leading this race. But it is special because we're here out in the middle of the woods celebrating America. NASCAR track in the middle of the woods couldn't get any better. Now you're doing deer hunting and all of a sudden you come out and see and hear a bunch of race cars. Yep, NASCAR's in town. Logano still leads. As Walker's gonna get the Hamlin in the 11. Hamlin, he's been winless all year long. Logano only one win on the year. Came on a road course back in Daytona race too, so way early on in the year. Elliott, he had, his last win came at Phoenix. Not this year, Austin Dillon won that race. It was the championship race when he went on to win the championship. This is kind of the same scenario that Kyle Busch had last year in 2020 when he won the 2019 championship. He won five races that year as well as Chase Elliott. Next year only won once. So far, Elliott has zero checkered flags on the 2021 season. Here is running second, probably gonna get passed for his position. Last time he was here was in an Xfinity car back in 2014 when he won, or excuse me, 2015. 2014, he did win the Xfinity Series Championship. And Logano up through the hill and 
Hamlin. Lugano will win stage one as Chase Elliott gets second, Walker third, Hamlin fourth, Larson fifth. That's your top five, and Push is in sixth. Now bring out the first caution of the day, meanwhile, as Chris Busher gets the final stage point. Kurt Busch, who's in the 11th place position, has two road course wins on the year. Chase Elliott's your new race leader as we get underway from Road America, as we're back racing here at Road America. Right, here comes Walker at the second place. Logano's going to get the lead. Gano just has a better, faster car, I feel like. I mean, Walker couldn't get up to him. I mean, Ellie and Logano, two of the fastest guys all weekend. Fastest car, in qualifying. Was Logano, Elliot second fastest. Walker's going down the straightaway here. This would be the front straightaway. Fastest part of the racetrack. Right here, and uh, he needs to get to Logano if he wants to win, if he wants to pass him for the lead. I think Logano has a bunch of experience here, because I don't know if he's raced here ever in Xfinity. I can't really tell that. I think he has. Oh, and he's off the grass. Oh, they're both being being on aggressive. Logano goes to the grass. He corner corner cutted. On a NASCAR like that, Hamlin spinning. Well, that's the second, third road course race in a row where he's had issues. Uh, the second road course race, third road course race in a row, he's had issues. Had issues in Coda, blew an engine while he was leading. Sonoma, he got spun out in the lead. And now here he is, he gets spun out third place. Now Walker. Nearly got spun by Elliott as he came on the track, so nothing wrong with Elliott there. I think it was just still Walker misjudging uh, when he came back on the track. Next race is Atlanta, a race that Walker does not want to go to, so he hopes to use this race as some momentum to go on into the rest of the summer months. Oh, and he spins out Logano! Logano goes spinning out. He goes breaking. And it's going to be who to the race lead? Defending champion Chase Elliott. Chase Elliott's never won in Road America in anything. Trying to win here in a cup car. He's going to go up the hill. At Road America here, and you'll see one to go in stage number two. One to go in stage two for Chase Elliott. Oh, Walker really fast going this turn. A little bit of smoke locks up the brakes a little bit. Walker is not great into the exits of the turns. He's really good into the entries here. Watch this. Gains a lot on him, but he loses a lot of ground when he gets off. He's going board up him. In third gear right now. Shifts that thing in the fourth gear. Two good road course races right here. Walker has finished second. He's finished in the top ten in every road course race this year. Elliott, he knocks Elliott loose. Yeah, walk, speaking of Walker, he had his worst finish on the road course this year. Eighth at um, Circuit of the Americas. Really great. Really great road course driver, both of these drivers. Well, they both start off racing golf or go karts. Walker did at the 61 highway track and near Welton, Iowa. The Chase Elliott they grew up doing it in Colorado. Now watch this. Watch his run on the high lane. He goes up high. Oh, he break. Oh, he oh he knocked the Walker off the track. I don't know if that was Elliot trying to be way over aggressive, but I think Elliot's trying to be over aggressive. Right, well, he's being over aggressive. Not trying to, he is. Walker's going to be really good through this corner. Going to be really aggressive. Trying to. Going through the S. Oh man, he's going to come around here. He's going to. 
take the uphill here. He's gonna go uphill. Jay Sally hasn't won anything. He hasn't won sports cars. He hasn't won go karts. He hasn't won Xfinity, and you know that could change a day as he comes out of up the hill. Chase Elliott wins stage two. Oh, he, oh, Walker hits the back of the nine. And it'll be Chase Briscoe again in st final stage point. As Kurt Busch, the winner of the last two row courses, gets eight. All right, Walker will take the race lead. Meanwhile, as we're back right away, he spins the tires. Chase Elliott to the lead immediately. Elliott to the lead immediately here. This is where Walker's been really good in the in the entry here. Oh, he's gonna run Elliott. Oh, he's gonna run high. He's not gonna run Elliott up high, but but he is there, challenging the nine. Oh, he's gonna challenge the nine car for the race lead here. Oh, side by side. These two guys wreck. The Larson's in looking here. Bush is looking here. Bell's looking here. Bunch of guys are looking to get a win this year. There are even more wins. Walker has the most this year with four versus the guy with zero. Walker will take the race lead from Chase Elliott. Oh, watch this. Oh, he's having issues. He's off track in the sand. Oh, man. That might have gave Chase Sally the race win. I don't know what did. Now he's running right behind. He's in 10th place running right behind Chase Briscoe. Like I said, his worst road course finish of the, of the season in his career is 8th at Coda. Seems to be every other road course he runs terrible at. He's in 8th place right now. He's going to run up behind Kurt Busch. He won that Coda race. Oh, he's gonna come up with Alex Bowman who won Nashville. For his third career win. Now coming up on Cursor Bell. In fifth place. Winner back here in August 2019. Last time that Bell was here ever in a NASCAR sanctioned series. Walker's coming up fast, by the way. Yes, sir, he is coming up here. He's gonna challenge Kyle Busch. He's gonna run Kyle Busch up the track. Oh, Kyle Busch runs to the grass. As we complete the first lap, we're gonna stay in the final stage. Kyle Busch nearly got spun out, four to go in this race. I think it is going to be spun out. No, it just got loose. Just got loose. He stopped. He stopped. No, he's going to get going here. That's all going to be. Matt Walker's car just catching Larson, and he's going to try to catch Elliott. Chase Elliott trying to win his sixth road course race of his career. Well, he has won in 2019 or 2018 at Watkins Glen. He won the final. He won four in a row last year. And Walker's in the sand trap again. Oh no! Again. Oh, he's gonna worse this time. He's gonna go out with the 13th. But he has enough laps. Where I think he can come back up here and. Try to steal a win. Fast car all week. This fast car. Call by 13th. Coming up on the 42 car, Ross Chastain. Trying to get back up here for the race lead. He's going to pass Briscoe again. On Oh man, that's now just an ill handling race car. Now coming off the 17 car, Chris Busher. Don't know what will have to happen if he wants to get up to Chase Elliott. 
and win this race. Rookie trying to win in his home track. Well, Luce there running up on the curb. Elliott's running away with this. He won the 2020 championship last year. They're getting a five win season. Coming at Charlotte. Charlotte. I'm trying to thank you. We're winning Charlotte. Daytona Road Course. Um, Charlotte Roval. Martinsville. And then the championship race in Phoenix. This year, he has won nowhere. Guess where he's trying to do that? A road course. Not at all a shocker. That Chase Elliott's gonna probably win this race. Said didn't win at all in his Xfinity career here. Didn't win at all here. Ever. Here we are in the first ever cup race since 1956. Second ever road course race here. Race here. Chase Elliott trying to become a winner. Oh, Cobbler's got knocked loose. Pretty sure that 18 car is fed up with the 41. Guys, uh, guys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, men and women. We're about to witness possibly a great comeback here. Well, he doesn't tell how many seconds he's behind Larson, but he's really behind Larson and Eventually, the race leader, Chase Elliott. Well, he sees Larson now. He's catching Larson. Watch this. Chase Elliott has a 12-second lead from the third-place driver. That's comfortable. Hell, that's overcomfortable. <laughs> you know that is overcomfortable. Walker, his second-worst finish of the road course race this year. Second, his best finish. Second. Best finish second on the road courses this year. Two laps to go from Road America. Walker is trying to win this race. At least trying to get up there to contend. He's going to catch Kyle Larson. I don't think Larson's just getting faster, faster every lap, and I think 41's getting slower and slower. Um, each lap, but now the 41 has caught the five. He's gonna go off track. Not what the 41 wanted right there. Not at all. 12. You know that that 41 car is gonna get off track here. Oh man. Catching Larson. Larson's running away with second place. Elliott's running away with the race lead and more importantly, the race win. It's getting this road course race. All the road course races has not had cautions for incident instances. Besides Sonoma, which I recently had one caution for incident. This race, zero cautions for incident. Yeah, I don't know if this 41 car will be able to catch a five. Let alone the nine. You got lucky if it gets the five, you'll... If we have ten more laps in this race, I'm pretty sure that 41 can catch the leader. We have one and a half lap left. Here in Road America. Oh, you catch Larson. He's getting closer. Coming up on the slog straight away. 
Hell yeah, Flea is probably gonna start sinking here. Watch this 41. He's gonna have to make it. He doesn't make it. Doesn't make it good. Chase Elliott's gonna take the white flag here on America. White flag is out from the jockey made America 250. All right, Spider said, bring it up to his final lap here. I'd be shocked this 41 car got second. Because the day he's had has been wild. He's also really good to that turn off through the grass. He's mowing it. He's mowing the grass. Chase Selly has an 11 second lead. Over the third place car. Who is just trying to reel in Kyle Larson? Walker's gonna get there, I think. To Kyle Larson. Reeling in that five car. Now he's really cast five. He's gonna get up here. He is gonna challenge the five. He turns Kyle Larson. Kyle Larson has spun out. The 41's in the trap. 41's in the trap. Chase Elliott can just cruise the victory lane right now. Spider tells him 41 and five car has spun out. 41's car is coming though. If he can get up to the spot, not car, will he use the bumper to get up to him? I don't think he will. No, sir, he won't. Fans on their feet screaming. Chase Elliott. He has been winless all year long. Here's your defending champion, defending series champ, Chase Elliott, who finally get his first win this season in his championship defense. Chase Elliott wins at Road America for his sixth road course win of his career. Chase Elliott finally does it. Woo, man. And we'll see you guys in Atlanta. And by the way, that was 13 different winners here.